Hello guys, welcome to another video of Hardware Centric. Today we are going to show you if your M.2 SSD is not showing in your desktop computer. Well, there are many reasons why your SSD is not showing up in your desktop computer. Well, we are going to show you with a portable flash drive. We, we're not going to show you with an SSD drive because our SSD drive is full and we can't make space right now. So here is a portable flash drive. Now let's go to our desktop. First, I'm going to open this PC and then Let's maximize it. Now I'm going to put in my flash drive. As you can see, my flash drive is here, but it's not showing up in my computer. Well, in these cases, what can you do? Well, first thing you should do is right click on Windows and go to Disk Management. As you can see, here is Disk Management. And after the Disk Management is opened, we have our flash drive here. And now what we should do is change drive letter and pass. When your drive letter is not set, that drive is not going to show up in your computer. So go ahead and give it a drive letter. Let's just say we're going to give it W. Well, it's really uncommon, so why not W? As you can see, I have now given it W. And voila, we have W here. And as you can see, it has shown up in my computer. So if your M.2 SSD drive is not assigned with a drive letter, the problem can be that if you have a new drive, then the storage can be unallocated. Let me demonstrate. Now I'm going to delete this volume, okay, because I don't have any important data at the moment. Now it's unallocated, right? So now what we should do is it's like removable W, but uh, we can't access it because it's unallocated. Well, if it's unallocated, then you should do is create new simple volume, create, click next, and then next, and then click next again with the drive letter. Uh, we're just going to give it NTFS because that's better anyways. And now we're going to click on next again and then we're going to finish. And now the unallocated data will be allocated to a specific amount. So as you can see guys, allocation is done and after the data has been allocated, now we can access our drive after the data has been allocated. So guys, if you have an M.2 SSD and it's not showing up in your computer, and if these methods didn't work, then make sure that your M.2 SSD has been inserted all the way and in the correct direction. So guys, if your problem has been solved by this video, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up. And if your problem still remains, then let us know down below in the comment section and subscribe to our channel for more great fixes like these. Until we meet again next time, goodbye and stay safe.